this is a game changing thing, okay? It's gonna change the meta entirely. Hello there guys and welcome to this video. So um, yeah guys, this, there has been a release on the advanced server and I guess most of you guys probably, probably, probably already know all about it guys, but I still want to show it to you, if, why am I doing so, so weird stuff with my hands? I still want to show it to you guys in case you don't know it, so um, yeah. The biggest part of this update is the way that Lord works and the changes in buffs, so we usually have two different buffs, which is what we have on like normal servers. There's the red buff, which increases its attack capabilities, and the blue buff, which increases mage-like like mana power abilities. Uh, and uh, yeah, you you all know how the red and the blue buff works. I'm not gonna explain that to you because you already know it. You're smart. I I believe in you guys. But anyways, we now have six different buffs, one for every type of class in the game. And I'm gonna show you guys the buffs just so you know everything about it. And uh, yeah, I also want your guys' opinion on this. I don't really like this to be honest. Like, it's a totally new meta. And uh, not really something that I expected them to do, okay? And uh, yeah, I'm also gonna talk a little bit about how the turtle and lord will work from now on. So um, yeah, I just wanna show this to you guys so you know. The things that you should know about the game. So um, yeah, we're just gonna get right into it, and I hope you guys will enjoy. Fighters. Fighter buff. Skill cooldowns reduced by 15%, skills will slow target's movement speed by 20%, and will last for 1.5 seconds. Assassins. Assassin buff. Skill cooldowns reduced by 10%, skill resource consumption reduced by 20%, and physical and magical penetration increased by 15 points. Mages. Mage buff. Skill cooldowns reduced by 20%, skill mana consumption reduced by 50%, and magic power increased by 30 points. Tanks. Tank buff. Skill mana consumption reduced by 50%, physical and magical defense raised by 15%. Marksman. Marksman buff. Increased 10% physical attack. Skill on hit will increase user's movement speed by 15%. Lasts for 2 seconds. Supports. Support buff, skill cooldowns reduced by 10%, mana regeneration increased by 50 points, and health regeneration increased by 15%. Okay guys, so that's it for the buffs. What do you think about it? Do you like it? Do you hate it? I don't know. Tell me in the comments below, because I really really want to know your guys' opinion. And me personally think this is gonna, like, well I don't think. This is a game changing thing, okay? It's gonna change the meta entirely, and like everything about the game, okay? Which basically is the meta, I guess. Uh, yeah, but like, this is gonna change the game completely. I, I myself honestly don't hope this reaches normal servers. I just, I hope this is just like some sort of test phase they have on advanced servers, because I, I don't like it at all. But that's just my opinion. What do you guys feel? Tell me in the comments below. Anyways, we're gonna go on and continue to talk about Lord and Turtle. So you can see on screen now we have the patch notes for this patch, and you can see here, Turtle spawns at 2 minutes in a random location. By random location they mean either the turtle area or the lord area, as far as I know. Lord spawns 3 minutes after the turtle has been killed in a random location. So, basically, they have reduced the, the spawn timer of lord by 1 minute if you manage to kill the turtle it at exactly 2 minutes. So exactly two minutes in the game, if you just go for turtle direct, then Lord will spawn earlier than usually. So that's one cool thing. And his respawn timer is set to four minutes after it's been killed. So to trigger Lord to spawn, you first have to kill the turtle. You then go on to uh, kill Lord several times because he will just respawn after that. You don't need to kill the turtle anymore. 
and that's basically how they work. So, um, yeah, I mean, there's not really much more to it. You can also see some stuff here. The giant mouth monster, which is this guy, he gives more health when you kill him, and the ghost mage and goblin grants more mana when you kill them. So that's one thing to keep in mind as well. But anyways, guys, that's it for this video. I really, really hope you liked it, and if you did, remember to hit that like button. If you didn't like it, press the thumbs down button, the dislike button. I, I don't know what to call that one. <laughs> But um, yeah, if you don't like it, press that and tell me in the comments why you don't like the video. I really want to know it and I really want to improve for you guys. So um, yeah, but that's it for the video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.